long time no see guys I have a bunch of vlog footage that I do want to upload but it's kind of sporadic it's like a week and a half time span so I didn't really know how to do this so I'm kind of just going to insert the clips in chronological order and talk you through a little bit of it so the first couple of clips that you are going to see are us in Portland. I say us because me and Audrey obviously live in Portland. If this is your first video, click out of it and go watch another video of mine because it's going to be very confusing for you. But if you've been following along on me and Audrey's story for a while now, then it will, it should make sense. So we obviously lived in Portland for a couple of months and we had to leave um, about a week early because Audrey's mental state was pretty severe. So that's the first clip that you're going to see. It's 10.20 p.m. on Saturday, March 3rd. And had a good cry fest. Um... Audrey is not doing well at all. So we're gonna go ahead and, what are you doing? She loves being in the suitcase. We're gonna go ahead and pack up and go home um, instead of driving back down the coast of California so that we can get Audrey into a, a doctor and get settled and get her medicine re-evaluated because um, she is not doing well mentally. My, I was getting ready to wash my face and then um, the whole breakdown started so I never got to. So now my makeup looks real great. Look at that, how chunky my mascara got. Good morning. It's 5.30 in the morning. We're gonna go ahead and hit the road. Um, so right now I'm screenshotting <clears throat> what I need for school on like on the internet so that Audrey can type and ask me the questions and I'll answer it while I drive. I really quickly wanted to show you guys the layout of the apartment. I was going to film an apartment tour this week, um, tomorrow actually, but plans change. <laughs> so here we go. This is the closet. Such a spacious size. This is the bedroom area. We could section it off with a curtain if we wanted to. There's a little like, I don't know, extra space. This is the kitchen. It's very cute and it's clean. Dining area. Living space. It's our front door. And this is our bathroom. So then after me and Audrey decided to leave Portland and drive back home, we decided to do it in two days instead of three like we did on the way up there. One of the days turned into a really, really long drive because um, there a blizzard happened so right in front of us. Like, we were in it. So that took a long time because I was literally going like 10 miles an hour for a while. Um, but anyways, those were those two days of road tripping back home.
wearing the same t-shirt for probably like three days, four days. <laughs> no, like three days. Audrey and I are in Twin Falls, Idaho, which is where we stopped on our way to Portland. Funny enough, but this time we just stopped to get gas and snacks. Audrey, do you want to show us? Well, I just ran into the gas station. I never buy snacks at the gas station because they're so overpriced. But when you're desperate, you're desperate. And I needed something to drink. So I got, I wanted a Gatorade, but they're so sugary and bad for you. These probably aren't that much better, but they're a little better. And it's way better than an energy drink. And this one's supposed to give you energy, but it's the vitamin water energy tropical citrus. It's really good. And I got Audrey some hot tamales. Audrey loves hot tamales. And we got some pretzels. Yeah, oh my god, how cute. We got some pretzels because we have vegan cheese and vegan bologna and vegan chicken. I'm um, eating vegan chicken and carrots right now. I'm just like a little lunchable. This is the vegan chicken, but we didn't have anything, any bread or pretzels or crackers or anything. So, yeah, but I'm driving now. So, Audrey, you wanna take over? Um, anything else? Oh, I also got myself a sucker. Where am I supposed to be going? Straight. You guys, we made it to a place called Gateway Inn, and it's literally this little thing right here. It's kind of creepy.
scared about the process of moving and stuff like that. Why? You are just going to move? I'm excited to pick out apartments. Yeah, that's the whole process of moving. We don't move that much stuff. We don't. Are you excited to buy stuff from thrift stores? You have no idea. That's what, Decorate. that's literally, literally. Yeah, I'm planning on going to Goodwill. Like as soon as we get home. Yeah, yeah, me too. I want to go to the one in Yukon. Yeah. There, I, I don't want to take it in like over two months, so now it'll be like. I want to take. I want to take our posters and see if we can find a frame for oh, them. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. Get them sized. We have two posters. We're gonna start our collection. I'm so excited to see what our decor style is gonna like evolve into. So. Yeah. That's the update. Talk to you later. So we left Portland Sunday morning at like 5 a.m. Then we stayed in Wyoming on Sunday night. Left Wyoming Monday, Sunday, uh, yeah, Monday morning at 5 a.m. Drove to Oklahoma, got there around 10 at night. I can hear the sound. Come to life and turn me right back around We're running through the trees Escaping our own death Forever in these words In this love or at least in my head um, Stayed in Oklahoma for Tuesday and Wednesday And then on Thursday We drove from Oklahoma, me and my mom Cassie, my older sister, and Audrey, my little sister, drove down to Texas, looked at apartments, found an apartment that day on Thursday, signed all the papers and everything, got approved that Friday, so the next day, and the day after that, Saturday, um, my whole family came back down to Texas. We got all moved in. They stayed the night. For a few nights and um, then they went back home the rest is history so I hope you guys enjoyed this video like I said if this was your first video it wasn't a great video to start off on but I hope you enjoyed it nonetheless and if you did please give this video a thumbs up thank you for all of your encouraging messages um, I know some of you guys like kind of sensed that something was up or a little weird if you're the praying type keep praying for us because we need it also if you want like quicker up-to-date things I post a lot more on my Facebook group which is Bedhead Beauty and I also post a lot of my Instagram I don't really describe much on my Instagram I kind of just post photos but I talk a lot more um, on my Facebook group Bedhead Beauty so you can just ask to be a part of that group and I will approve you and yeah that's that the links to everything will be in the description box below by the way also comment um, questions that you have I might do a Q&A pretty soon um, so yeah, if you have any questions at all, it can be about anything and everything. Um, I don't care. I'll answer it if I see fit. And that's all. Bye, bedheads. And sometimes it's okay That it hurts, you just wanna feel And pain only hurts because it's real Sometimes it's okay That it hurts, you just wanna feel and pain only hurts because it's real Cause I can feel you breathe, I can hear the sound